And now she's asking for a pile of pancakes. No question. Grandma, wake up! We need to make pancakes! Oh, um, I know how to do that. Grandma and Shab kneaded the dough so quickly that no one even noticed it. And now they're frying pancakes. It looks delicious, but I can do better. I'll add some food coloring to the dough. There'll be different colors. Wow, Handy decided to place the baby with something unusual. Look what a bright colored dough he has. It'll be very tasty and beautiful. Oh. oh. You're so sloppy, Andy. And in general, pancakes are best with some maple syrup and a piece of butter. What? This is a simple, proven over the years recipe. Pancakes with maple syrup? This will not surprise anyone. Here's a serving of pancakes from a professional. I'll need an egg for that. This recipe is called poached egg. It is necessary to boil water in a saucepan and break the egg directly into the water. And while it's cooking, I'll take slices of ham and leaves of greens. And I'll put it all beautifully between the pancakes. Awesome. <laughs> it's time for the baby to appreciate the efforts of the participants of the challenge. First from Andy. They're simply delicious, especially in combination with marshmallows. And now let's try pancakes from Grandma. They look pretty simple, however very tasty. And pancakes from the chef look unusual, but the raw yolk of a poached egg is disgusting. The baby did not appreciate it. And the victory goes to Andy. Yeah, I won! Let me fix it for you. Don't touch it, Grandma. Attention, everyone. The baby wants a juicy steak. No question. Grandma can do it. Are you sure? Yeah. Okay. I'll be fine. That's it. We take it and fry it. Nothing complicated. How can you fry without oil? You need to lubricate the grill pan thoroughly. Yeah, I'm going to add oil too! Duh. Oh, Andy, don't add so much oil. And of course you should try to get oil in the pan. Now we throw a piece of meat into a frying pan and fry it. <gasps> wow! <laughs> Impressed? Come on. Absolutely! Oh, uh, I can do it too! <laughs> of course, Andy, the main thing is not to miss the frying pan. Oh, uh, I didn't miss! <sighs> oh, young man, watch and learn! By the way, my steak is almost ready. Now you can also add some salt. <laughs> cool throw! Big deal! Hey. Grandma, look, I'm going to give you a lift now! Look, ready? I'm like a real chef! No! Oh no! It fell on the floor! <laughs> yes, and it collected hair and dirt, and it's also raw and undercooked. <laughs> uh... Uh, maybe she won't notice? Oh, my God. oh, you can't serve a dish like that. I don't know what to do. I'll pour more ketchup. It'll hide all the flaws. That's it. Mm, it smells great. Oh, thank you, Mia. My steak is really beautiful. It remains to add springs and rosemary as a decoration. And that's all your decoration, Grandma? I know something better. Mia knows the secret of the famous golden steak. It'll be a real golden steak like in the most expensive restaurant. Meat should be cut with a sharp oh. knife so as not to spoil the appearance of the steak. Awesome. Oh, that's how it is. I didn't know it. Ready? Now you can serve it. <laughs> Finally, you can try the dishes. Meat with ketchup does not cause the baby's appetite. Um, just look at it. You can see the hair endured. Oh my. And the golden steak. I wonder if the baby will taste it. Hmm. hmm. It seems delicious, but not impressive. Grandma's steak smells delicious, and most of all, it came to the baby's liking. Simple and no frills, but what a taste! Grandma's steak undoubtedly takes the first place! I won! Hooray! It's time to eat dessert, and the baby wants to eat… ice cream. <laughs> Oh, I know the recipe's fried mm -hmm. ice cream. Her grandma can make ice cream? Okay. Nothing complicated! Oh. So what is in the recipe? You need to chop it into small pieces. Okay. Hmm. How beautiful! Now I'm going to chop it into pieces too! <laughs> Easy as pie! I like chopping ice cream! Watch your knives, young men! And don't throw food around the kitchen! Ugh, got carried away! Sorry, Grandma! 
<laughs> That's what happens when amateurs get to work. Meanwhile, I have already prepared everything. It remains to complete the dish with a beautiful serving. Nice. Everything turned out perfectly. I'll decorate the ice cream with lemon zest. The sour taste of lemon is perfectly combined with the sweetness of ice cream. Some mint lips and some smoke of dry ice. This is how ice cream is served in the most refined restaurants. Awesome. Just look at this. Incredible. <laughs> wow. Grandma also prepared everything. Cut and twist. Um, uh, it's not really working out. The ice cream stuck. Okay, let's just put some chocolate syrup on top. No. <laughs> That's funny. I'm almost done too. Nothing complicated. <laughs> now I'll put in a bowl and decorate it with whipped cream. I love it. I'll have much more for the baby. And now I'll sprinkle some rainbow Skittles candies, a sugar straw for beauty, and some Oreo cookies. Please. Grandma, will you let me? Okay. Oh, thank you. Now I'm going to pour oh chocolate God. syrup. Oh, yeah. so much sugar. Oh, yeah. Let's see what the baby <laughs> thinks. The colored ice cream from my brother looks incredibly beautiful. <laughs> But the gorgeous presentation from the chef struck the baby more. Time to try it. A oh, lemon says it's too sour. Ice cream slices and chocolate syrup looks unappetizing, but it tastes nothing unusual. Finally, it's time to try the ice cream from the brother. Whipped cream, sugar straws, and Skittles. Incredibly delicious combination. And the winner is… Brother. Yeah! I knew it! Grandma, let me hug you! Everyone concentrate, we continue our culinary duel. The next request is a croissant. The French really like to eat croissants with coffee for breakfast. Oh, Grandma, are you from France? Do you know how to cook croissants? Grandma knows everything. They can be put in the oven and let's wait for it to cook. Ah, I can do that too! One second and let's bake! Hmm, well done, yeah. grandson. I don't approve of frozen dough. Cooking it yourself is not so difficult. By the way, our chef Mia has worked in the best restaurants in Paris and knows the oldest recipe for croissants. According to the recipe, dishes were prepared for Louis himself, the king of France. Therefore, the baby is waiting for a truly royal dessert. And the brother and grandmother watch the chef actions in amazement. How devilish she kneaded the dough, laid it out in layers, and twisted it. What a skill! It remains only to put it in the oven and wait. I won't be able to cook so cool, but I'll add Nutella to my croissants. Oh, my favorite chocolate nut paste. Mmm, delicious. Oh, what kind of manners. It's time to get their croissants. Mmm, how wonderful and rosy. Andy? Look! You're on fire! Oh no! Not that! The brother got carried away with Nutella and his croissants burned down. Yes, the chocolate paste is really very tasty. Don't worry, you're doing great. Yeah, croissants are baked. It's time to start serving. I need an incision and you can pour out prepared cream. I'll add strawberries and I'll decorate the dish with powdered sugar on top. Voila! Everything is ready. Now we can try it. Burn croissants from the brother look terrible. Yeah, it's not worth trying them. Ugh, oh, what a smell! Croissants from grandma are delicious, sweet, and so nice! Our baby really liked it. Wow, strawberry sweet cream and delicious dough made according to the royal recipe. Mm, Without a doubt, yummy. croissants from the chef take the first place. Oh, thank you. I knew that. And I have a whole pyramid! And that's it. How lucky I am. Tina has only one. And look, that's oh. hilarious. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah, come on. Mm, only one thing. And I did not catch it. Yeah, that's terrible. Come on. You have to eat it anyway. Okay. Mm, it's kind of delicious. Look at my bubble. <laughs> That's funny. Ah, oh, what have you done, Tina? <laughs> Come on, I'll jump it up. Oh, your eyebrow. Oh. Oh, I know what to do. I think so. I'm gonna put it back. Okay. Oh, my brow's back. 
Thank you. Hey. I couldn't do that again. Uh, what? What do you care? Okay. Come on, easy try now. Mm. Okay. Hmm. Gum is so delicious, and I'm gonna make a real bobble. Not like Tina's. Oh, oh look at that, awesome. Tina. She has a bubble. We're gonna pop it. Pop it. <laughs> yeah, that's a good idea. And pop. Oh, what have you done? Now I have a beard made of gum. What? What are you laughing at? It's fine. Now I'm gonna make a bowl and stretch it. Mmm, and eat it again. Ew, that's disgusting. Your turn, Oscar. Come on. Okay. I'm next. I broke my tower and hurt my hand. Well, what are I gonna do? Girls, no. No, no, no. It's all mine. Hmm. Gum is pretty good. Let's blow a bubble. <laughs> cool. Look, I have a balloon now. <laughs> Perfect. So cool. Hey, don't touch it. You're gonna pop it. I'm gonna put it on my chair. Don't you dare touch it. Huh. Ooh, more balloons. Yeah, we're really bored. Huh, so many balloons made of gum. So cool. I love it. Huh. What? Am I flying away? Girls, help me. No, no, no. Ooh, look at those marmalade eyes. I love it. I have a whole planet of them. <laughs> you have only one. Look, Tina. <laughs> How unlucky Julie is. Well, I love marmalades, but yeah. enough is enough. One is good, too. Mmm, such delicious strawberry feeling inside. It's gorgeous. Ah, mm, so good. Come on, Oscar, your turn. Hooray, I'm so hungry. Hey, actually, it's my turn now. Oh, that's right. I have an average portion, which means I'll be done in a couple of seconds. What could I've come up with? How do you like my manicure? Isn't it cool? And also, it's very tasty. Wow. Tina's lucky. Yeah, I just love marmalade. What's wrong with my throat? Oh no, I can't breathe. Uh, 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 Tina, are you okay? Whoa! Thank you, Oscar. Don't even dream about it. Now it's my turn to get all this marmalade into my mouth. Cool. These marmalade eyes are so delicious. I just can't stop. Whoa. Stop it. No, 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 no. I want to. There's enough only for me. Oh, you've already eaten yours, Julie, and you too, Tina. These are all mine. I'm almost done. Only two different feeds left. Come on, give us one by one. No. And no. Ah, oh, that was delicious. Oh no. Do I have ice popping out of my hair? Ah! Whoa, french fries. How is it I have only one fry? Yeah, even average size is not enough. Whoa, I got lucky. Look at that, a whole tower. Ah, <laughs> Julie, what a bummer. You have only one fry. Yeah, funny. <sighs> what a smell. <sighs> Poor fella. Eat already. Mm, I'll eat it whenever I want. Mm, I want to prolong the pleasure. Oh, wait, no. It's so delicious, I can't wait. What? Come on, you eat yours now. Whatever you say. I'm going to eat french fries with sauce. Mm -hmm. It's delicious, isn't it, Julie? Huh. Now I have two of them. Bingo! Hmm, I know what to do. I'm gonna teach him a lesson. I'll add some hot sauce and use ketchup. No one will notice. Uh, I know it'll be so hilarious. Oh. Uh. Mm, so delicious. Oh no, that's a hard one. I'm on fire! Ah! Ah! Wait a second, I know what to do. Here's the water, I'm gonna save you! Oh, God, thanks, Tina. 
Thank you very much. Please stop splashing, Oscar! Stop it! I'm sorry, come on. I have a great idea for my french fries. I'll take ketchup and pour it on top like a fountain. Just like that. Oh, the ketchup is cool and smack it delicious like that. Oh, the ketchup is all over. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, no, no. What do you think? It's all mine. Mm, so delicious. Oh. Bingo. Ooh, I know what to do. She's greedy, but I bet she doesn't know to do the one. Mm, so delicious. I have potato stuck in my throat. Oh, no. Uh, uh, I'm gonna help you. Come on, get it out. Uh, not a problem. Here you go. Oh, man. oh, come on. Come on, Oscar. Was that a fry? Was that my fry? Huh. Well, your own body taught you a lesson. Oh, I've got only one donut. Hmm. Let's try it. What? Oh. Yeah, I have four. And I have a whole mountain of them. That's some fear. How oh, lucky. We want some more, too. No, no, no. It's all mine. Come on, eat your one donut. Okay. Bingo. Hmm, I know what to do. I'm gonna eat it slowly to prolong the pleasure. With a knife and a fork. Just like that. Mm. Well, not so long. Oh, my God. Ah, yeah. Like you're from high society or something. Well, awesome. I'm done. It's your turn, Oscar. Ooh, hooray. I have ten donuts and I'm gonna eat them all at once. Oh. Can't wait. Oh, ew, so greedy or something. It's so delicious, girls. Oh, I love it. Mmm, so good and sweet. Ooh, leftovers. Mm, delicious. Are you an animal or something? Ew. Uh, I think I'm done. And I was clean and now I want some more. No, these are all mine. Stop it. Okay, I have a whole mountain. And I'm going to eat it all. Mm, I want some too. Oh. Oh, wait. I've got an idea. I'm gonna put them on top of each other. And I'm gonna eat them as a burger. Whoa. What? How are you gonna fit that in your mouth? Uh, nice. Guys, how do you like it? Oh no! Oh no, no, no! No! Uh oh. Yeah, looks like your greediness didn't come in handy. Sorry, guys. <laughs> it was so much fun, though. Well, the alarm is already ringing, so it's time to get up. Let's see what day it is today. I completely forgot! It's Halloween on the calendar! This is good news! It's time for terrifying pranks! First, you need to transform a little. And now let's start preparing the first prank. I need a balloon, a white cloth, and a black marker for it. <laughs> Look, it's a real ghost! I didn't expect that it would turn out so plausible. I'll hang it in Mia's room. Great, she's still sleeping. This is my chance. There's not a minute to lose. I'll leave the ghost right here, right under her nose. That's not all. I have some very scary gloves. I'll try to put them on Mia. It turned out great. Luck is on my side. It remains to scatter the balls all over. I can imagine what will happen if you step on them. And the final touch is slime. How well it stretches. I don't even want to let it out of my hands, but it's necessary for the sake of my prank. Well, that's it. Finally, I'll close the door with a poster of a brick wall. Let's see if Mia can find a way out. What is this? Oh my gosh! I've been attacked by a ghost! So Wait, it looks like it's not real. It's probably all Susie. Oh no, my hands! Oh, calm down, Mia. Don't panic. It looks like just gloves. Well, it's time to deal with Susie. What does she think she's doing? Oh, what is my face in? Damn it. What a terrible start to the day. Hold on, Susie. The wall? Where did the wall come from? This is some kind of madness. 
Hi, Mim. Happy Halloween! You asked for it, Susie. I'm going to get my revenge on you. It's my turn to make a prank. Believe me, it'll be much scarier than yours. I will use a wooden countertop with a hole in the middle and black cloth. In my opinion, it already looks very gloomy. Now I'll put a large bucket of popcorn right on the hole. Great. I'm putting in popcorn so that nothing can be seen. Super. Have the work done. How do you like my new look? Isn't it scary? To create an ominous atmosphere, you need to turn on a horror movie, a dim and the lights. Now complete silence. Just watch and I'll hide under the table. Oh, a horror movie. Great. I wanted to see this. And there's popcorn here. Super. What's wrong with it? I must have imagined it. Surprise! Oh no! Someone bit my finger! What the hell? Is there a monster in the box? You guessed it! I need to run! I'm sorry, Mia, but I'm definitely not stopping now. I still have a lot of pranks in stock. For the next one, I will use an artificial arm. It looks like a real one. And the suitcase with the tools? We need to get a drill. Super. Uh, it's time to decorate the house for the holiday party, but nothing comes out. I see you need help. Look what I have. Let me do everything. Thank you, Susie. Oh, I want to sneeze. Oh no! I punctured my arm! Help! Susie, what should we do? Oh no! What a huge hole! I feel bad. I didn't mean to, but she bought it. What? Is that Susie's hand? It's not real! I almost tricked again. Well, it's time to make a strong move. Let's see what I have. Yeah, I think a bald hat is perfect for the next prank. It suits just super. And some brain on top. It was good, but something is missing. For example, blood. I'll take the ray paint and smear a white bandage in it properly. And then I'll wrap it carefully around my head. <laughs> I'd be scared of that too. It looks really creepy. I'll put on a wig so that Susie doesn't suspect anything ahead of time. I think it suits me. A real cutie. The sign is the final touch. i leave it on the back. It'll provoke Susie. Hi, Mia. Sit down to watch a horror movie with me. What is that on her back? It's been a long time since I pulled anyone's pigtails. What is this? I think I pulled out all Mia's hair! Surprise, Susie! <laughs> That's hilarious! I made it! Trick or treat. <laughs> we have our first guest. Hi, there's for you. Actually, you should have taken a few sweets, not all of them. Oh, never mind. I'll teach him a lesson. I'll cook special chocolate eggs. To do this, I'll take the real ones, pierce each one with a wooden stick, bathe it in chocolate, and add packaging. It turned out great. Trick or treat. It's you again. Here, I've prepared some new treats. Let's see how much you'll like them. <gasps> what a catch! It looks like I took everything from them. I love Kinder Surprises. Ew! A raw egg! This is disgusting! I've gotten into it and I don't want to stop. We need to arrange a new prank. I'll use pumpkin for it. The main symbol of Halloween. I got a great jack-o'-lantern. It remains only to put candles inside. That's it. I think I should put this right under Susie's bed. It's good that she's not here. I need to hurry up before she comes. Super. Jack Lander is in place, but that's not all. I'm going to need Susie's sneakers and Ray paint. I'll smear the paint to leave bloody footprints in the carpet. There's nothing better than this classic prank. The paint is ready. I'll put it on the carpet and press it properly. Super. <laughs> Today was a very busy day. I'm so tired. What is this? It looks like blood. Oh my gosh, I'm scared. Someone broke into my room. Oh no. Oh no. Let's get out now. You're so impressionable, Susie. 
And how did I not immediately think that it was you? Stop laughing, Mia! Get out! <laughs> didn't hit! Didn't hit! I was just joking and she's already throwing pills at me! I need revenge and I think I figured it out! I'll take the snow white towel, spread it on the floor, and leave my bloody paw prints on it! I noticed that this scares Susie more than anything in the world! This is the effect I'm trying to achieve! Super! I'll leave a few more! Now you can hang the towel in place! That's it! Don't suspect anything right away! We need to come up with something else. One towel is not enough. And what if I add red paint directly to the shower head? <laughs> this will definitely scare Susie to death! Everything worked out, and most importantly, I didn't leave any evidence. <laughs> a bloody shower will be a complete surprise for her. Another brilliant idea. I'll leave a scary soap message on the mirror. This will be the last drop for Susie. I'm watching you. I think that's ominous enough. I would like to see Susie's reaction to all my pranks. The main thing is, don't give me away ahead of time. It's time to wash out this day. A shower always helps me relax. How nice is this water? But why is it red? Is it really blood? Surely me is prank. I'm going to dry off and find her. Oh no, the towel is covered in blood. What is this? Someone is following me! A nightmare! We need to leave! <laughs>